in this video we are going to see about computation of depreciation and value of farm assets and valuation of assets by different methods first what is the meaning of depreciation depreciation means fall in the value of assets because of usage time or by accident depreciation is a procedure to account the cost of services uh, during the usage of these assets during one production cycle this is also known as capital consumption allowance depreciation involves spreading of the original cost of an asset over its entire useful life depreciation is the permanent and continued diminishing of quality quantity or the value of assets depreciation is a non cash expenses that reduces the exact value of an asset over time due to wear and tear of its use the methods used for calculating depreciation are straight line method declining balance method and sum of the year digit method in straight line method the annual depreciation is calculated by subtracting the salvage value from original cost and dividing it by expected life period this is a simple and easy method this method is useful for durable assets like buildings and fences next the declining balance method in this method the depreciation per year is calculated by subtracting the accumulated depreciation from purchase cost and multiplying it by rate of depreciation next the sum of the year digits method in this method the annual depreciation is calculated by multiplying f with amount to be depreciated depreciated the f is nothing but year of remaining life at the beginning of accounting period divided by the sum of year digits this method is suited for assets which are relatively higher depreciation during earlier years of their life next the common methods of valuation valuation at cost in this method the amount of money is taken into account only during the acquisition of the assets its limitations are it cannot be used for valuation of farm products the effect of inflation and degradation are ignored original investment value has limited use next the net selling price this method is generally applied to the assets which are primarily held for sale on the farm it represents market price less the selling cost it is an effective method of valuation for crops and livestock it cannot be used for valuation of buildings and machines next the cost minus depreciation in this method the value of assets can be estimated by subtracting the depreciation from the cost this method assumes that the purchase price of an asset approximates its value this method is used for the valuation of machinery and breeding livestock replacement cost in this method the value of an asset is equated to the cost of reproduction of the asset at present prices this method may be successfully employed for the valuation of fixed and long lived asset next the replacement cost less depreciation this method provides a realistic valuation of fixed and long lived assets like buildings particularly when wide price changes may occur however this method should be used carefully as may often lead to over valuation next the income capitalization in this method for the assets like land contribution towards the income can be measured income capitalization is an ideal method of valuation present value can be calculated by dividing the per year return by interest rate per annum